Hi guys, today I'm going to tell you my secret of changing the colors to something more fun without working too hard on it and you can trust on this process because I have tried and tested it many times. It can be considered as a secret trick actually that will for sure change the way you have colored all these times unless you have already discovered it on your own. Without further ado, let's get into the video. First, you need to hide the background color and the highlight layer. Then go to the layer which is just below the highlight layer. Copy the whole thing by clicking on Add layer from canvas and again duplicate that copied layer. Clip it to the layer below. It's important because we don't want the color to be spilled everywhere. Go to FX, click on draw, then choose concentric gradation. I have chosen this option. You can choose whatever combination you like. I'm going to show you how to do a fun hair color. Go to the hair layer and just duplicate it. Then put it on top of the modified layer. We will be following the same rule like before. Duplicate the hair layer once again and clip it. But this time change the layer mode to lighter color. Now please listen carefully. Go to FX, then choose draw and go for radial line gradation. Change the count number to 2. Try different combinations and try to find out which one suits the most. I have chosen this specific one because I like how it glows and I am a very big fan of glowy thing as you can already tell. So that was my choice. You can choose anything you want. I wanted to keep the same style but change the color. So I changed it to blue and purple because I have a very very soft corner for blue. If you want to change the color, you can just go to adjust color and choose hue, saturation and lightness. Now time for the bonus part. First, duplicate the modified painting layer and change the layer mode to darken. Go to FX, click on blur, choose lens blur. Then you have to change the opacity around 50 to 60. The reason I'm doing this to give the art a softer look. I love myself some soft looking portrait so I do that a lot and I thought let's share this secret to you guys as well.
we need a new background layer for this new style. Again, I chose radial line gradation to get myself a bright, vibrant background color. So that's it for today, hope you got to learn the secrets and will apply this to your own arts. If you do that, don't forget to tag me on Instagram. You have my link in the description. I would love to see how it worked out for you. Thank you for watching guys and I'll see you next week.